Did you know the United States owns fewer than half a dozen icebreakers? And only two of them are heavy duty. For a country bordered by the Arctic and Antarctic, that's like having a navy with no ships to sail in winter. Icebreakers are no ordinary vessels. They're the battering rams of the polar seas, designed to smash through ice sheets that can be up to 10 feet thick. They clear frozen shipping routes, resupply research stations, and extend a nation's reach into the world's coldest, most resource-rich frontiers. For the U.S., that means protecting strategic interests in the Arctic, a region where Russia and China are fast expanding their presence. And now, Washington is finally making a move. President Donald Trump and Finnish President Alexander Stubb just signed a landmark pact at the White House, one that will allow the U.S. Coast Guard to buy up to four icebreakers from Finnish shipyards. Finland is home to some of the world's best icebreaker engineers. Their vessels dominate Arctic operations from Europe to Asia. By partnering with them, the U.S. hopes to fast-track its long-delayed Polar Security Cutter program, a fleet modernization plan aimed at building the next generation of American icebreakers. The goal is clear, to expand U.S. polar capabilities, counter Russian and Chinese activity in the Arctic, and revive domestic shipbuilding in the process. The first of these Arctic security cutters could set sail by 2028, with construction shared between shipyards in Finland and the U.S. Because in the new Cold War, the one fought over ice, resources, and influence, the real power belongs to those who can break through it. 